A few days ago, I made a video trading seven preppy pets, and now all over my Discord, I see people talking about exotic pets, and I have no idea what that is. So once again, I went to the Discord and asked, what are exotic pets? And some of the answers I got are forgotten pets, and pets that are very rare and not very available. But before we trade, if you want your own Mega Neon pet, leave a like on the video, hit the subscribe button, and comment down your Roblox username. Also, don't forget, use star code fishy when buying robux all right i'm just gonna get straight into it we're gonna start off with the chameleon there's a chance you get the task with the rgb box and then there's a chance you actually get one from the rgb box so they're kind of difficult to get all right so we have the first person and what is going on they have all these rare eggs but oh my gosh they have a lot of rare eggs actually not exactly what i'm trading for right now but it's very tempting i wish i had an offer but I already traded some of my best pets for eggs, so we're gonna have to move on from this trade. All right, so we have Candy Kitten now. Let's see what their offer is. They put a Fly Ride King B. It's also full grown. I don't really know what the chameleon is worth. I know it's kind of difficult to get. I'm gonna hit accept in case they wanna do the trade. I'm not sure if I'm making a bad decision right now, but it's a Fly Ride King B. This is a Robux pet, also a little bit difficult to get. Whenever I hatch bees or throw the little bee thing or the honey, whatever it's called, I always get the regular bees, so. They're not that easy to get. I think this might be worth it. I'm not exactly sure. I'm going to hit confirm. I don't know if they're going to do it, but I would love to do this trade. I would love to get a King B right now. And there we go. We traded the first exotic pet. Moving on to the next one, we have a Rhino now. I don't know exactly what makes these exotic. I think just because they're hard to get. I really don't know what exotic means. I'm trying my best to catch up on all these adopt me terms. If you guys have any idea what it means, comment down below what exotic means. I am trying to learn. I am just going by what my Discord says. And if you guys want to join whenever I ask questions or be in videos, the link to my Discord will be in the description. All right, so we have an offer for the Rhino. We have a legendary pet, the Maneki Neko, some Bloodhound Dog, the Zodiac Minion Chick, Woolly Mammoth, the Toxic Bearer. I think that was Robux. I'm not entirely sure. I might do it just because I'm almost positive the Toxic Bearer was Robux. I could be wrong. Wait, is that still in game? Let me quickly check. I don't remember. If you guys know where the Toxic Bearer is from or how much it was, comment down below. I almost think it was Robux. It was like a one week item. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I already went to the second trade window. I never backed down from the second trade window, so we're going to hit accept. I feel, I feel like I took a loss. I'm not entirely sure. Comment down below. Was that a bad trade or a good trade? All right, moving on to the next exotic pet. Someone kept on saying to do the Capricorn. I feel like this is an exotic pet. I think this was around 1,100 Robux. You had to buy a house for this. Or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of the wrong thing. I'm not entirely sure where the Capricorn is from. But everyone keeps on saying this is an exotic pet. I'm not sure if they're right, but I'm going to trade it. All right, so we have an Easter egg 2020. I mean, I love the Easter eggs, but I don't think it's worth as much as a Capricorn. These are like a thousand Robux. I don't know if they're still in game. They might be. I think you need to get a house for it. I really don't know. I could be wrong. Maybe it's not the one with the house. I could be thinking of a different pet, but I am going to pass for now. All right, let's keep on trading though. Let's see what offers we can get. Oh, we got a snow owl now. Not bad. That's a legendary pet. Okay, I'm going to stop trading for the minion chicks. I forget how common they are. I feel like every time I see one, I'm like, oh, wait, it's a legendary pet. I have to do it. And then I realize these are really, really common. As cool as these pets are, I think I'm going to have to pass. The snow owl is also a really cool pet, but I don't think I can do it. Not for the Capricorn. I feel like this is worth way too much. I could be wrong, though. Maybe it's an AMC pet. I really don't know. I already forgot. All right, so we have Aiden now with a Blue Scarab, an Octopus, Badger. Let's see what else. Oh, a Platypus. Okay, I might do it for the Platypus. I'm not going to lie. I love the Platypus. All right, there's a lot of legendary pets here. Even the Ancient Dragon. Okay, I'm going to do it. Maybe I'm doing a mistake right now, but I really, really want all these pets. It's like five legendary pets, I think. Wait, one, two, three. Okay, I was wrong. It was three legendary pets and three ultra rare pets, but the platypus is a hard to get pet. So I'm not mad about this trade if it actually happens. I'm going to hit confirm and let's see if Aiden does the trade. And there we go. We just traded the third exotic pet. We got ourselves a ton of cool pets out of that. All right, so I was going to trade the next exotic pet, which is a platypus which we just traded for, and they put three parrots, two of them being no potion. I have no idea what they want. I don't think this is an offer for this, so I'm gonna decline. But yes, the next exotic pet we're gonna trade is a platypus. I think this one is really hard to get. This is definitely really hard to get. So I think that's what exotic means, just hard to get pets. I could be totally wrong. I have no idea what I'm doing here. 
but i am trying my best that's why i love reading the comment sections to see what you guys think exotic is or what you guys know exotic is because i am clueless when it comes to these things i had no idea what preppy means even now i read a lot of the comments in the last video and i kind of learned a little bit of what preppy was so shout out to all of you guys that helped me out i do appreciate it i read all the comments all right, I will definitely do this trade. I feel like it's a fair trade. I know it's a lot of random pets, but it's like four or five legendary pets and a ride of pet potion. I feel like that has to be fair. Now, if they don't back out, we can finally move on to the next exotic pet. And after this, this will be the fourth one we traded. We're going to trade seven of them in this video. Let's see if this one goes through. We wait and see. And they <laughs> declined the trade. So we're still trading the platypus. All right, so we have three legendary pets and some ultra rare pets. I might actually do this offer. A lot of these pets have a ride potion. Honestly, it looks like a really crazy offer. And they even put a fly potion at the end. And there's a chance I get a T-Rex or a Dota bird now. I don't know if that's a real offer. I hit confirm. I would love to do this for the exotic platypus. I think it's exotic. I don't know, guys. I really have no idea what's going on. I'm just listening to whatever my Discord says, and I guess the YouTube comment section can correct me later. I'm gonna hit confirm. I don't know if that's gonna be real. I guess we wait and see. And there we go. We just traded a door for all those items. Shout out to them. For the next exotic pet, we have the Mecha Puff. I don't really understand the Mecha Puff. It's a cool looking pet, but this is one of the pets that almost everyone agrees is an exotic pet. I don't understand why, but we're gonna trade it. Someone offered a Mega Fennec Box. Wait, I don't know why I just hit accept. I was gonna think about it. The Fennec Box is still in game, right? It's an uncommon. I feel like it doesn't really have value, so I don't know why I hit accept. I saw Mega, and I immediately just clicked confirm, which was kind of a mistake, I think. I mean, I never go back on my trades. I already went to the second trade window. I'm gonna do it. I don't know, guys. Was this a really bad trade? I feel like it really was. A Mega Pup for a Mega, what was it, Fennec Fox? Oh, no. That was bad, wasn't it? I'm gonna give it back to them. <laughs> there we go. They got back their Mega Fennec Fox. All right, the next one we're trading is the Meerkat. Let's see what offers we can get. We're almost done with exotic pets. They put a Neon Dragon. I don't know if that's a real offer, but I don't know if this is a win or a loss. I'm gonna do it just because it's a legendary Neon pet, and I'll give this away to one of you guys that leaves a like on the video and comments down Dragon. All right, so we're trading Marley the Great now, and they put an Aussie Egg. I'm gonna risk it. Oh no, I was gonna hit accept. I was gonna risk it and hopefully I can get a kangaroo or turtle from that. They're putting more eggs, but I just want the Aussie egg. I'm just gonna spam accept. Okay, there we go. I did it a bit too much. Oh wait, they removed one. All right, they're gonna keep the one egg, but I'm gonna risk it. I don't care. Let's hit confirm. Let's see what happens. And there we go. We just got the Aussie egg. All right, let's hatch it now. Let's see what we get. Please, let's see if that was worth it. And we got, okay, that was not worth it. We got a bandicoot. 